Hi, I'm Brian Trenchard-Smith, and this is Trailers from Hell. One of the most controversial death penalty cases of the 1950s was the trial of 19-year-old Derek Bentley, who became the victim of a criminal justice system less concerned with justice than sending a message to delinquent youth. Elvis Costello wrote a song about it entitled Let Him Dangle. Alex Cox was originally going to direct this film but dropped out. It passed to Hungarian-born veteran director Peter Medak. Some say his most notable film in a long and continuing career is The Ruling Class, which got Peter O'Toole an Oscar nomination. But his best, in my view, is Let Him Have It. Let him have it, Chris! Five words are at the core of this tragic story. Was it a plea to surrender or incitement to murder? Peter Medak stylishly recreates a post-war England still enduring rationing and high unemployment. The easy availability of war surplus firearms, combined with youthful rebelliousness, worried the government. Two teenagers were caught in the act of burglary. 19-year-old Derek Bentley quietly surrendered. 16-year-old Chris Craig began shooting, wounding one officer and killing another. Such a crime meant a mandatory death sentence. At 16, Craig was too young to hang, but Bentley, being over 18, was not. The prosecution argued a point of law known as accomplice liability. The defense inexplicably failed to tell the jury that Bentley, due to head injuries suffered during the London Blitz, was epileptic with a mental age of 11. He was also illiterate, yet his dictated confession was full of standard police jargon. Christopher Eccleston and his screen debut engages your sympathy as the hapless Bentley. Tom Courtney conveys the agony of a parent in this situation. And Michael Goff is chilling as Lord Chief Justice Goddard, whose directions to the jury read like an extension of the prosecution. He had an agenda. It was time to teach miscreant youth a lesson. As injustice mounts, you can feel your anger rising, and the climax packs an emotional wallop. It's a great British film about class prejudice and abuse of power. Check it out.